Alright, I'm Josh McCougar here with Schmoes No Podcast on Oscar Sunday. I'm here with, what's your name, sir? Zan Overall, believe it or not. Zan Overall, that's a family name, I'm guessing. Zan is an old Martian name. Zan is an old Martian name. Okay, interesting. Now, what is your sign? What's your sign on? Well, I have several of them. Uh, Spielberg, these are things that didn't get into the movie. Okay. The fact that Lincoln was a dictator. Sure. A racist, a okay. war criminal, and worst of all, a lawyer. Right, right. Now, why do you say that? Well, I, I can't. You probably don't have time for all of it, but a dictator. Just give me the cliff notes. Right? Yeah, the, yeah, all right. A dictator. The Zan notes, if you know. Zan notes. Yeah. Yeah. If you were a northern, uh, you had a newspaper in the north, and you were opposed to his war, and a lot of people in the north were, Lincoln would would send soldiers and break and, and break up your presses and put you in jail. Interesting. And that's what I call a dictator. And, okay. and most people don't know it because they go to the public schools. Okay. And where, did, and where, where did you go to public school? Yeah, but I finally voiced up. Okay. And where did you find out this information about Lincoln? Uh, well, there's a, a very good book by Thomas D. Lorenzo called The Real Lincoln. He's okay. an economics professor from, uh, from uh, Maryland. Maryland. Terrifying. Uh, that's good. Now, now there's something of, of worth on your program. Okay, excellent. Now, what's your other, what's your other signs? Yeah, show us, show us some more uh, of those signs. Oh, okay. Oh, there we go. Jewish Hollywood, 2013. Uh, propaganda disguised as entertainment. Right. I've been coming down here for years with a sign that says uh, Hollywood, whatever year. Propaganda disguised as entertainment. And I got these three, uh, these three, uh, four, four, Lincoln. Four. Django. Django is is uh, uh, pushing us in the, in the direction of a race war. Right. I don't know. think that's a good thing. Right. Now, do you think that Lincoln would have liked Django, or he would have not? He would not have liked Django. Uh, no, that would be too much for him. He, too much. He, he wasn't a great friend of blacks. He wanted to send them to Africa. Did you know that? Most people don't. Well, I mean, I think a lot of them wanted to go back to Africa. No, no. The, the, the abolitionists, the right. Kate Garrison, the famous, uh, they hated Lincoln's guts because he, he, he had that opinion for years and years. No, but he did pass the 13th Amendment. That that helped free the slaves, right? Uh, finally, yes. Okay. So him pushing that amendment through, that meant he didn't like blacks, is what you're saying. Well, you know, before, before the war, uh, before the war, there was a uh, thing before Congress that would make it uh, uh, unconstitutional to ever change the, the, the right of Southerners to uh, uh, to hold blacks. So he, he was all over. He was a lawyer, for God's sake. He was, he was all over the map. A lot of, yeah, but lawyers uh, they defend the Constitution. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. They might have a creative way of doing it, but hey. But you, want a, you, want a quote, you want a quote from Lincoln? I would love a quote from Lincoln. All right. Something that isn't four score and seven years ago. Yeah. 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 He, uh, Learn something new every day. Lincoln, he had a great command of the English language. Sure. Here, here's this uh, in a debate with uh, with uh, Douglas in 1858. Okay. He wrote, I'll, I'll make it a little shorter. I will say I have never been in favor of bringing about in any way the social and political equality of the white and black races. I am not for being in favor of making voters or jurors of Negroes, qualifying them to hold. So, you know, I, sometimes I, I, words get twisted. Oh, I've never been in favor of bringing about the socially, political equality of the white, white and black races. So spin that for us. So, spin okay. that, later. Okay, so what you're saying is, is that Lincoln freed the slaves to make himself look good, but he himself didn't like blacks. African he, wanted them, he wanted them out of the country. He wanted them in Africa or Haiti. Never that's, that's why the uh, abolitionists hated why, his guts. Why did he want them hating Africa, though? He wanted them to be. He's racist. He was racist. It says